Right, welcome back guys to another new video so today video i'm going to show you where to locate your ignition coils for those who don't know what an ignition coil is and where to locate it i'm going to show you how to locate your ignition coil in a 20 cm iron the elantra so first to remove this your coil i'm going to remove the cover i'm going to pull up go to the front also and remove it so guys so these are your ignition coils oftentimes your car skipping or missing oftentimes those those coils goes out so this is one two three four piles right here you have your injectors so you have four injectors so each injector is each feed each coil. So while the engine is moves in operation, the coil is in a spark, the injector feed it with, with gas and keep the engine going. And which are your cam sensor. There's another one around the back here. So something I find a car not starting, even though you're getting current, you might not get getting any current to the coil because your cam sensor go bad or crank sensor, yes, those things can cause your car not to start. The engine turnover and it won't start. And here's your auto sensor. Now it's called oxygen sensor. So calculate the the fuel mixture of the car and right down in the hole here this is your heat sensor that's for this fan so let the fan chip in and out work off a temperature so when the engine heat up that switch send signal to the fan and the fan spin to cool the engine so your alligator right here The engine mount right here also. I'm just showing you guys a few little things in the engine room. This is the ground strap. So you're throwing the engine oil trunk. Engine oil with your dipstick. And this is their coolant buckle. So it's there a, a, a full mark and a low mark on it. So when it's on the low, you need to pop it up or check it to have a leak. This is a radiator cap. And it's a 1.1. 1.1. .1. And so this is what the injector looks like. That red thing on the hole here. So that's the injector on the hole right here. Why I've come to it. Now I'm putting back the cover. And this switch is for the AC to let chip in and out. Yeah, yeah. AC pressure switch. That is their um, ABS module for the brake. This is the motor part on it. So when you press the motor, press the brake when you're going fast, or pick up any shock and match the brake. That helps to stop the car. This is your brake booster. Brake booster. This is the master cylinder. That's goes to the booster. This is the oil reservoir for the brake fluid. This is your battery right here. This is your fuse box. So you have a fuse box in the engine room here and also inside of the car. The 
This is your ear cleaner go. So ear cleaner goes right here inside this box. This is your PCM ECM computer for the car. It's right here. These are the water holes that go to the radiator. So the water working cycle in the engine. The pool. So this is the radiator right here. So the water goes through it, the coolant goes through it and the fan cool it. This is the windshield wash washer. This is where I throw the windshield washer in. Right there, between your windshield. This is all the on right here. So you press the key, press the button on the key, to lock the car, you press it two times, so you get that kick sound. That is what that on for right there. On the other main on, that blow when you press, when you unkit while driving, underneath the fender bumper. Right here is the chuckle body, electronic chuckle body. So you accelerate inside the car, send signal to this. The chuckle body right here to give the car power. The alternator send signal, charge your battery. So this way, this way right here. That's where sure show the battery light in the car. You know whether it's charging or not charging. When you switch on that position, you will see the battery light on. So this is what we do. Battery charge from this terminal connection right here. So you remember all the way to the battery. To charge the battery. Okay, yeah, so guys. So that's it for now. Find the Twitter useful. Please like, share, comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you all for watching. Another time. Bye.